Okay, this is a test of the audio. If the audio is good, then the video will be good. And it might actually be usable. So, audio test. What's up guys, it's Jack from Diamond Wake here. And today's a bit of a different video because I will be unboxing my new longboard that I just got. So, I'll explain everything while I start unboxing it because I feel like it could take a while. So, let's get into it. Sorry for the not typical knife flip. Don't have my regular knife. The gold one, the iconic one that I always flip open anytime I open something. I am in a different setting as you can see. I'm in college now, so I didn't bring it with me. I brought a different one because I like it. And if I lose it, I don't want it to be gone forever. So that's basically the top of the box, and then you're gonna pull this out, and the long word's gonna be in it. So the board that I got, it's pretty tight in there. Um, the board that I got, as you probably might have seen by the box, is a Magneto. Hana Longboard. Um, that is the company logo, Magneto Boards. There you go. Um, I believe it's 42 inches long, and this is the twin version of it, I believe, which is more of a freestyle kind of board. It's not a cruiser or a carver, it's kind of in between. And I don't know a ton about longboards. I just got one because I feel like it'd be easier to ride campus around on it. And it has the word board in it, so I figured it can go on the wakeboarding channel. And maybe I'll become a god at wakeboarding after this. So, coming on the board, I just pulled this out of the bag. This is a tool that you use to tighten the trucks and the wheels and stuff. That will come in handy, I believe. And longboard out. So, I'll take this thing out. I don't really need this here. So the first thing that I can tell about this is the top, there's no grip tape on the top. It's just wood and it does have a sanded finish. So it looks like they just put a bunch of sand on it. So you can use that instead of grip tape and it keeps the nice wood look. I feel like that's pretty cool. Um, don't know how it would compare to having grip tape over it because I don't know a lot about longboards, but I might in the future if I get pretty into it. Um, the wheels are orange, red-ish. They say Magneto. Um, I may have the look. Let's see how much they spin. Okay, a decent bit. They spin pretty good. I feel like once the once the bearings start to seat and I use them a little bit, maybe they'll start to spin more. But yeah, I bought it to ride around campus and we'll see where it goes from there. So, cut to some cinematic support. last clip I jumped up and down on the board to show the flex um, don't really know what it means or how much flex this board has it's my first one um, but for people who do know and that meant something to you you're welcome um, 
I personally am pretty excited to try it and to learn longboarding. It seems like a, a fun activity and there's a lot more to it than I think just riding around. Maybe progressing and learning freestyle, dancing, maybe some tricks on them, some shoves. Um, we'll see, I don't know. Maybe I'll do a review in the future later if you guys really want it. If you do want a review in the future, make sure you leave a like on this video and let us know. Um, yeah, but here's a bit more specifics on the board. So it is the Magneto Hana Twin Longboard. It is 42 inches long. It is made out of full bamboo on the deck and it does have sand on the top instead of grip tape because it's going for that surfing kind of feel. So if you take it to the coast and you surf a lot, it'll look like a surfboard and it might feel like a surfboard too, but you would have to surf and ride this to know that. And I have never surfed in the ocean, only behind the crash. So the wheels on it are 78 millimeter Shore 78A wheels. Um, don't know what that means either. Um, if you do, please let me know. Um, maybe I'll figure it out eventually, but I know that they're wheels and they spin and they're probably really good at it because that's their only job. The wheelbase on this board is 32 inches. So that's the length from wheel to wheel. The deck is 42 inches, so add five inches on each side and you'll get that. And it has a slight W concave, so it's made for cruising and freestyle and possibly those types of things. But it is technically the hybrid board between what they sell, because they sell one that's a pintail and they sell one that's a straight carver or cruiser, and this is the freestyle in the middle. So I figured I'd go with that so I can get a taste of everything and see what I like. That basically is going to wrap up the unboxing of the Magneto Hana Twin Longboard. Overall, I don't know much about it or longboards, but I feel like it'll be a good option for me to start longboarding, start cruising around campus, and maybe in the future start learning some tricks. If you guys want to see a review of it, make sure that you leave a like and leave a comment letting me know, and we'll see if we can work that out in the future after I get some more hours in this board. Comment down below, leave a like, and subscribe for more videos in the future, possibly of longboarding, probably of wakeboarding though. Peace. That's not a peace. Peace. <music>